There's so much that we could talk about when it comes to the topic of texturing. In my new course, The Fundamentals of Texturing in Blender, we're going to cover all of it. I'm Jonathan Lampel with cgcookie.com, and in this new course, I'll take you through everything that you need to know in order to get started texturing in Blender. We'll start off learning all about how Blender saves and loads images, as well as what texture coordinates are and how you can use them to manipulate your textures. From there, we'll take a look at how you can apply two-dimensional images to three-dimensional models using the process of UV unwrapping, and how to solve a lot of the common UV unwrapping problems that beginners face. And that's just chapter one. In chapter two, we'll talk all about digital color and how that applies to your textures. You'll learn all about color management, what every single type of blend mode does, and how to use all of the different color material nodes. We'll even cover what file formats to use and how that affects the color and quality of your images. In chapter three, we'll go over the principles of physically based shading again, but this time with an emphasis on the textures that you're going to need to create. Chapter four is all about procedural textures, and you'll learn to combine shader nodes together to create a few different procedural effects from the ground up. And by the end of the chapter, if I've done my job right, you'll be ready to tackle the lava shader challenge. In chapter five, we'll switch over and talk about texture painting, how to prepare a model for painting, how to use the brush system in Blender, how to paint with layers, and at the end, I'll walk you through painting a low poly axe by hand using nothing but the default Blender brush. Chapter 6 will finish things off with a few workflow tips and briefly introduce a few intermediate topics that you might want to explore next, such as trim sheets, decals, texture baking, and more. And then to top it all off, the final challenge will be to take this motorcycle model and create a custom paint job for it to prove to me and yourself and your mom and the guy who said you couldn't do it and the entire world that you now know texturing and how what it takes to make something look really cool. If that sounds helpful to you, then you can join the course by clicking the link below. It builds off all of the other fundamental courses that we have, so you can always watch those first or you can jump right in. As with all of the other CG Cookie courses, the lessons are broken down into bite-sized chunks, so you can take it at your own pace. And if at any time you have a question, you can just ask it below the lesson and I'll get a notification to come help you out.